but there's still this part uh, where I need to share with the whole community that uh, we need there's still some uncertainty right because uh, with uncertainty the investment risk goes up Christmas uh, take five. Fourth December want to be concise so uh, this video wanted to use it to document my thought process of uh, what I saw when CCT uh, declared uh, 20 days uh, financial results okay. uh, it has merged with uh, CMT and, and CCT to become the Capital Commercial Integrated Trust so I'm back here at uh, Asia Square Tower 2 so uh, in this video which is where right now at this segment I'm going to put in the Excel file there are basically three slides that I wanted to do I basically built the entire entire retirement portfolio for my parents uh, based on REITs and through this COVID-19 I, I discovered that I am kind of heavy on uh, office it gave me an even more compelling reason to go and observe the results so what you could see here in the first slide is more of uh, the rental revenues and other, other revenues but more importantly is the total revenue for the first quarter of the financial year the second quarter of the financial year and the third quarter of the financial year first quarter the total revenue was 103.6 million the second quarter is 92.8 the third quarter is 94.7 million when I saw this trend uh, I was surprised isn't the COVID-19 impacting the office landscape there's all, all these measures of social, social distancing probably the office spaces would have been left empty and ten, tenants may start to say hey uh, I, I would like to stop the lease any because uh, the the team practically isn't utilizing so when I saw the third quarter results which is uh, a huge shape turn from uh, 92.8 million going back up to 94.7 million um, that was like maybe this reads like a good news or this sounds like a good news so back then I was like okay now if the read has merged should I put in more capital that's where we go to the second slide right uh, in the PowerPoint or the slides that you can download, hopefully uh, I've also appended a uh, Excel file which uh, hopefully you can open right? if not, uh, you can always uh, head to my Facebook page uh, Ask Min An How To uh, drop me a message and summer, uh, my chatbot assistant uh, will assist you accordingly okay. what we see on this page right now is that um, basically two different images one is a capital commercial read and the other one is capital more I put up both quarters no up to the third quarter that means uh, Q1, Q2, Q3 of uh, capital commercial trust alongside with Q1, Q2, Q3 of capital more and I added them up together because one of the things that after a merger happens is hey what will happen to the financial results so I basically added both uh, of course I don't think that is the right way to do but I wanted to have a quick assessment of hey if right now if the share price was at 1.73 right but as of now uh, 6 December I think it's around $2 so back then it was like 1.73 should I buy at the current at that particular share price of 1.73 so I just did a, a addition of both uh, financial results of both uh, uh, entities and or businesses um, I came to a conclusion that I wouldn't because I believe in the Excel file the dividend yield was only 4.4 percent right but this is assuming where uh, a COVID has uh, reduced the amount of distributions Right, so that was how I decided or landed out the decision that uh, I wouldn't put in any more capital right now until I get more 
clarity as an uh, as an investor clarity came in via the form of a cleanup distribution which I've moved to the third slide uh, I've also appended the capital commercial trust uh, cleanup October results PDF uh, for your for your viewing um, and there's one page where it shared the first 20 days of the financial results of the fourth quarter right uh, gross revenue up for the first 20 days was at 21.7 million so what's the probable fourth quarter results what I did was uh, just basically 21.7 million divided by 20 days times 90 if I did that the final revenue that are estimated for the fourth quarter assuming all things are constant meaning that there isn't any more uh, lockdowns because uh, for CCT, uh, the primary um, property distribution or perhaps I'll say the property pro properties are in Singapore, right? And uh, Singapore had the luxury of uh, being able to open up uh, or perhaps able to contain the number of uh, COVID-19 cases. So that's why uh, workers or the office spaces are now uh, a bit more lively than during the, uh, during the lockdown periods. So assuming those conditions are constant, right? Uh, you will see that next to it, right? There's a calculator image of uh, showing a revenue of uh, ninety-seven point six for the office space inside the new merge suite, which is the Capital Land Integrated uh, Trust. The office has gone back to its normal levels despite knowing that right i just need the fourth quarter results which would be announced by the read right to have even more confidence of putting in uh, additional dollar of capital so this was the thought process to let me know that hey why uh, even after the read merge i did not put in any additional capital but i also wanted to know after the covid 19 has the office segment of the integrated trust uh, went back to its normal levels right now my first assessment it seems like it's gone back uh, to normal uh, second quarter was its lowest uh, that said I'll be waiting for the final quarter results to be released then uh, I'll plan my next move so this Excel file is meant to allow you to understand what I felt I would expect but there's still this part uh, where I need to share with the whole community that uh, we need there's still some uncertainty right because uh, with uncertainty the investment risk goes up so oh, do our best we only do our we do our best to move at times where things are clear so right now you do not have to immediately put in more additional capital to go and buy uh, any more any more shares of the business uh, because that relates to the other video which I'm going to do because I received a question from the communi community uh, about uh, two other reads which I have no vested interest with at all but the key idea is always the same please walk the ground uh, as of today 4th December compared to my last visit back here in August definitely there are more people streaming into this whole building so uh, really look forward to uh, receiving the financial results of the whole integrated trust and yes stay tuned to the other video